What's up guys and welcome back to another video. So in today's video, it's actually a really, really exciting video. And we're going to be talking about how Bitcoin could be breaking out upwards of 10K in the next few hours or few days. So really, really interesting coming up in today's video. We are also going to be taking a look at how BitMEX has actually been accused of money laundering and market manipulation in the new lawsuit, which has come out, which is crazy. We're then going to go on to take a look at Grayscale Investments, tops new all-time high in assets under management and the bitcoin they are holding guys is absolutely crazy we're going to be taking a look at that in today's video and finally we're going to round off the video by taking a look at bitcoin or the search term on google buy bitcoin is actually pretty much at a 12 month high which is really nice as well as some great bitcoin price analysis guys all that is coming up in today's video so as always sit back relax and get ready for the video All right, guys, what's up? Welcome back to another video. Thank you for joining me again. I do really appreciate that. If we can hit that target of 1K likes, that would be absolutely amazing. You guys know I appreciate every single like that you drop. Also, guys, if you're watching my content, you do enjoy it and you haven't already subscribed, consider subscribing and ticking that notification bell when you do subscribe so you get notified and stay updated with my upcoming videos. As always, guys, drop your comments down below. You can literally comment anything below to win this Ledger Nano X storage device or the equivalent in Bitcoin. So drop your comments down below right now so guys let's go ahead and take a look at the bitcoin price first of all starting on the daily chart the very obvious thing which i covered in yesterday's video the golden cross of the 50 and the 200 day moving average is pretty much happening as we speak which is really really exciting and um, hopefully this can be bring a bit of a bullish nature to bitcoin and this can in fact help us break out of this um just overall difficult time which we're having to try and break around this 10k level so the 10k level we all know uh, it's been a fairly difficult level for us to break um, however we could be breaking it in the next few days which would be very very interesting um, I do think we are in this ascending triangle a couple of other youtubers have covered it um, I recently watched Chris's video on this and he says we could be breaking out very very soon and I think that's a great point um, if you did want to check out that video I'll have it linked down below I do think we could actually be a uh, breaking out of an ascending triangle very soon uh, and this could be very nice and if we do break out this ascending triangle guys one thing i want to be careful of personally is this 10.5k level uh, if we go back on to the uh, we're already on the daily chart but if we go back this 10.5k level has been a little bit of an issue in the past when we have in fact broken out of this 10k level so we can see here we are actually below 10k right now we're currently at nine thousand eight hundred dollars give or take and if we do break this 10k level this could be very, very interesting. However, this 10.5k level, which is highlighted here with the red line, could pose a little bit of a threat to the Bitcoin price um, if we did want to go ahead and break out even further. So just be careful of that 10.5k level. We could easily break out of this 10k level, wick above, and then get rejected and come back down to the 10k level. That would be fairly reasonable. However, I do think if we can break out of this 10k level, it should be fairly bullish for Bitcoin, uh, and it should be very, very nice. Combined with this um, golden cross which is happening, that would be absolutely amazing. So let's go ahead and take a look on the four hour chart now. So we can quite clearly see here, now we are on the four hour chart, that we are in a nice ascending triangle. Now this triangle has been uh, actually touching the upper side here once, here almost twice, and here again three times to the upside. The downside, we have multiple touches here. We have pretty much a touch there, and we have uh, a few more touches up here. So we can, we can see that's actually confirming the ascending triangle, which we are seeing. Uh, and personally, I think we are more likely to break to the upside than in fact breaking to the downside, but I'm gonna cover both options just in case. As I said before, I think more likely we're gonna have a break to the upside at least above 10K. That 10.5K level could be a little bit of an issue, but at least above 10K, I personally believe we could be breaking that in the next few days. Downside, we do have this 9.5K level here, um, which we have been on multiple times. We've found support on multiple times. Below that, we have the 9.2K level, and the 9.2K level, guys, we know this is a rather large level. Um, we can see here we've touched it multiple times. Here we wicked up to it and found resistance. Um, again, here we found resistance. Here we found the support, sorry, if I didn't already mention that. So the 9.2K level is a fairly large level for us to hold. So if we do, in fact, break downwards and fall through this 9.5K 9.5K level here, um, we do, in fact, have this 9.2K level here. 
um, which looks uh, like a fairly solid hold. Other, other than that, guys, I really do want to break up above 10K uh, and break that 10.5K level, as I've been saying many times in my videos. I think that's a great level to watch out for, um, and it should hopefully break in the next coming days. If you guys were interested in trading, um, pretty much I recommend Femex. My link will be down below. If you actually join Femex using my link and deposit only 0.2 Bitcoin, you get a $112 free bonus, which is great because you can use that to trade with it as well. Um, so that's pretty much Femex. Um, you guys heard me talk about it before. It's great. And if you were interested in learning more about leverage trading, it's only really for the more experienced traders. But if you were, in fact, interested in learning more, just scroll down on this video and actually below the video right below my name, you'll see a one hour free training lesson. Um, this goes over some basic and key principles on how to trade with leverage. And it's about an hour long training lesson. And that's completely free. Um, that will be down below as well, which you can click and check out. So now, guys, I just wanted to bring briefly cover a little bit of Ethereum analysis. Um, I get a lot of comments asking, hey Jack, can you talk about Ethereum? I don't talk about Ethereum too much. I do like it. I do hold it. Um, but I just wanted to quickly uh, bring that up in today's video. So Ethereum, recently we've had a big struggles here about this $230 level. And we also are finding it very, very hard to get above this $215 level. Uh, as we can see here, we did break it right here. Um, but unfortunately, we wicked back down below and got rejected. So this $215 level is very, very important for Ethereum. And right now we can see we've been testing it one, two, three, four, many, many times uh, very, very recently, especially on the four hour chart. And hopefully we can, in fact, go ahead and break this $215 level and come up to this $230, $227 level up here, which we wicked up to back on the 30th of April. So only a few weeks ago. That's pretty much it for, the, for Ethereum. It's not really um, I wouldn't say it's not interesting, but the price, it just needs to break above 215 for it to remain reasonably bullish. So let's move on to the first article of today, guys. BitMEX accused of money laundering and market manipulation in the newest lawsuit. This is absolutely crazy. A new lawsuit has been filed against BitMEX um, or filed against the parent of crypto der derivative exchange BitMEX, HDR Global Trading Limited, as well as ABS Global Trading and its co-founders, Arthur Hayes and Ben Dilo, um, accusing them of illegal activities such as money laundering. The 106-page lawsuit filed on Saturday um, by the U.S. District Court for the Northern District of California alleged that BitMEX was designed to engage in illegal activities such as racketeering, money laundering, and market manipulation, earning the defendants billions of dollars in illicit profits. Um, that's basically what they said. Um, according to the defendants' own data, defendants' unlicensed money transmitting business admittedly processed on average of $3 billion of illegal and unlicensed money transfers each day. $3 billion each day, which is crazy. Um, all in violation of the U.S. federal statute, federal statute which is uh is the record volume for such unlawful activities in the entire history of monetary regulation in the United States. That is just crazy. It goes on to say the defendants Hayes, Delo, and Reed have created a defendant ABS as a false shell company um, as part of a board of the United States federal state law regulating and tax uh, regulation and tax Dodge designed to, to tell regulators and tax authorities that BitMEX has no California, United States operation operations or investors uh, read the lawsuit. However, in reality, California is where most of all of its technology and services are managed and developed and where almost all of the key personnel who work uh, and perform functions live work and run BitMEX's operations. So it's basically saying how they're claiming they're not in the US, but they all live in the US and they all work on BitMEX from the US. That's basically what it's saying. Of course, this stuff is just the opinion of the article and it may not actually be true as this is just the early stages of it. Um, they made it, put out a statement saying we, we, we will confirm, uh, we confirm we will be defending ourselves vigorously against the suspicious claim, which is very interesting. BitMEX has had a lot of backlash recently, or not even recently, probably over the past year about what's going on behind closed doors and the counter trading and everything like that. Let me know down below, guys, if you are using BitMEX, if you stopped using BitMEX, if you think they are running something shady behind closed doors, let me know your opinions down below and that will enter you to win this uh, Ledger Nano X storage device. 
Moving on to the next article now, Graysdale Investments tops new all-time high in assets under management. Um, I won't bore you too much with this article, but it is very, very bullish for Bitcoin. And they're actually holding a crazy amount of Bitcoin. The current report indicates that the current assets under management total 3.8 billion. 3.3 billion of this is in its Bitcoin trust. Around 290 million is in the Ethereum trust. Uh, as the funds grow, the, the firm continues to hold increasingly large percentage percentages of all existing Bitcoin. 3.3 billion in Bitcoin at the current price roughly puts the firm at around 350,000 Bitcoin, slightly less than 2% of all Bitcoin in circulation. This is absolutely crazy, guys. I would be more than happy just to have 350 Bitcoin, let alone 350,000 Bitcoin. This is absolutely crazy. And I will zoom in, zoom in on this here, guys, so you can read a little bit about it. If you did want to pause the video right now, you can read it so you don't have to go over to the article yourself. But basically, Grayscale Bitcoin Trust, 3,368 million, around 3.3 billion, um, which is absolutely crazy guys so moving on to the last bit of news now um, the search by bitcoin is actually at a 12 month high we can see here last time it was this high was back in uh, june of 2019 and we all know what happened then that's when bitcoin that very nice level of fourteen thousand dollars right now we're currently up at these levels and we're only seeing around a 10k Bitcoin price. So this could signify that we are going to have a massive explosion in the Bitcoin price in the upcoming days and weeks, which we are most likely expecting um, at least to go above this 10k mark up here, which would be very nice. So that is pretty much it for today's video, guys. As always, if you were interested in trading and you are a more advanced and experienced trader, my link for Femex will be down below. If you use my link to join, you'll get a $112 bonus if you deposit 0.2 Bitcoin or more. And also, guys, if you were interested in more free training about leverage, just simply scroll down on this video, and you can see in the under my name here or in the top of the pinned comment, you'll actually find the link to the free trading sessions, uh, and that's actually an hour long. So thanks for watching today's video, guys, and I'll catch you in the next one.